Hello everyone, you're here with me Mr. Dabber on Before You Munch, where we take a look at cannabis edibles. Today, we're going to be taking a look at Habit Cannabis Tincture. Who is this for? What does it look like? What does it taste like? And is this worth your hard-earned money? We're going to find out all this and more on today's Before You Munch. But first, let's talk a little bit about Habit. In the winter of 2015, two friends set out to brew a cannabis beverage with an emphasis on using quality ingredients and only the finest A-grade oil extracted from organically grown cannabis. On a shoestring budget, the team set to work in the garage in Southern California, not even knowing if such a drink could be created. After months of trial and error, the team was able to perfect their proprietary extraction, formulas, and flavors to create the very first batches of Habit soda. The end result was a naturally flavored sparkling fruit juice, sweetened with natural fruit sugars and infused with Habit proprietary water soluble cannabis extract. A few months later, the team's efforts were validated when their first batches were named Best New Drink by High Times. Habit went on to win multiple awards in the following years, quickly becoming the most awarded and best-selling cannabis beverage in California. Habit has since expanded their product line with the same mindful commitment to the quality and respect to their craft to provide patients with a number of effective and innovative options to medicate. From beverages to tinctures to vapes and concentrates, Habit has created something special for everyone. Here we have the Habit Cannabis Tincture. It's water soluble, meaning it's really easy to mix with a lot of your different beverages. This one's mango flavored coming in at a thousand milligrams of THC in the whole bottle. It's rapid onset and nano encapsulated, meaning that it takes 15 to 30 minutes as opposed to like an hour to actually kick in. It's extreme potency and has natural flavors. Down here, you're gonna see that it's mango tincture, thousand milligrams, 1.8 milliliter per serving, and that's gonna be 10 milligrams per serving. When it was packaged, when it's best buy, and that it's six ounces in the whole bottle. Turning it around, you can see it contains 8% juice in the supplement facts. It has about 100 servings per container, less than one gram of sugar per serving and 2.6 calories. Just to throw it out there, it does say some, it does give you some suggestions over here to get creative. So you can put it with your yogurt, smoothie, iced tea, your waffles, ice cream, or cocktails, really up to you. I like to mix it with my sparkling waters and make some micheladas, but that's me. Made with real fruit, that's pretty awesome. It comes with a dosing applicator that I'll show you when we open it. It's highly concentrated, dilution is recommended. It has no high fructose corn syrup and it's sweetened with real fruit sugar. So that's awesome. Again, water soluble, nano encapsulated THC for ultra rapid onset and extended half-life. Here is the easy dosing guide. So two milligrams is about 0.35 milliliters. Your average 10 milligrams is 1.8 milliliters. If you're like, I don't know, 50 and above in this, I will recommend getting a uh, get, get a medicine cup. It's easier to dose. Here's the directions. Good time, add to your favorite beverage, or you can drop under your tongue and hold for about 30 to 60 seconds. Here's a warning, a warning, and it's vegan. Let's go ahead, let's open it up and see what it looks like. Take it. So when you open it up, you're going to get these two items. This is the actual syrup right here. Water soluble, tells you all the same things that you're gonna see on the box, so it's pretty awesome thousand milligrams, mega dose, full cannabinoid profile, that's awesome. All right, instructions, remove the cap, fill to brim, and pour under tongue. So they also recommend you can use the cap as a doser. Again, it comes with this little syringe. It's pretty nice if you don't have anything else you can use. It's a one milliliter. That's what I'm saying. If you want 50, you have to do nine of these. If you want 18 for 100, I was doing 32. So. I highly recommend going on Amazon. I'll probably put a link on my video. Uh, order these, just order these. Do yourself a favor and order these. It's just way easier if you're a heavy doser, if you're just trying to really have a good time. I mean, you can just to the 20, to the to the brim if you're trying to do a 200, and that's how usually I measure my micheladas. So what you're gonna wanna do is just peel off the little plastic and push down and twist. Plops right out. Go ahead and pour some in this little shot glass so we can see what it looks like. You take like a half shot. Oof. Nice and orange. Really not too like goopy, as you can see. And ooh, it smells like super mango. All right, bottoms up. Whoa. Ooh. Ah, I will say that's delicious, man. I am a fan of the habit, just personally. That's why I'm making the video because I want y'all to know that I really enjoy it. And if you see habit and Maybe you want some kind of alternative to alcohol or maybe you're just looking for a bang for your buck because the way that I see it, a lot of the times you won't find a thousand milligrams for the same price that you'll get this. So all in all, I mean, 
Is it worth a munch? I'm gonna say yeah. I can't wait to show you guys uh, the michelada that I like to make with this kind of drink. The different flavors give options to different types of drinks that you can make. You can get really creative with this. So do I recommend it? Hell yeah. Uh, if you see it, try it. If you don't like it, let me know in the comments. If you have tried it, let me know in the comments. If you have any other brands that you think I should try, let me know in the comments. And do me a favor, like the video, subscribe to the channel for more. And if you'd like to buy me a dab, there's a link down below for the coffee. Uh, and, and you can buy me a dab and I will truly appreciate you. All right, y'all. Uh, happy dabbing. Have a good one. Peace out. Dabs are on me.